So I picked up an injury exactly two weeks ago. Um, initially as a result of stretching at yoga. I think the stretch was overdone. Uh, it was assisted yoga, so I think there was more pressure applied than should have been. And at the time I felt a twinge, but ignored it, thinking it's a normal muscular twinge. I compounded it by the next day uh, playing golf. I walked the entire course, and it's only when I came off the course, had a hot bath, that I noticed the knee had started stiffening. And I had a very painful night, um, couldn't sleep because of the pain, and when I woke up the next morning, um, I could barely move my, my right leg. So that's when I initially telephoned uh, Mark, uh, who I was playing golf with, and he suggested that uh, he would ask Parag and Mihai to come and see me. Uh, Mark, had, Mark is the professional he's golf. the professional golfer, yeah. that's correct. Um, he had actually mentioned the treatment earlier. He said he'd been having treatment for a shoulder injury and that it had helped him. It was a bank holiday, so I had nothing to lose because I was going to go to A&E and I thought I'd try physio rather than wait in A&E for six hours. So Mihai and Parag came and treated the knee um, for over an hour with, with, with the equipment, massaged it, uh, slightly stretched it and created space in the knee and left it that, that to say we'll come back in 48 hours and um, we'll see where we get to. The problem was that overnight uh, it got far worse. I couldn't stand on the foot at all. So the following morning I went to uh, a &E at the Clementine Churchill Hospital where I saw a knee specialist. He initially thought that it was a meniscal tear in, in the knee and he suggested that before he started any treatment I should have an MRI scan done. Now at that stage it was so painful I couldn't walk. He suggested a knee brace and he gave me a walking stick um, to support myself because I, I just couldn't move. Um, in the meantime I carried on with the treatment that Nidhi and uh, Bragg had suggested. Um, on the Wednesday uh, that was 48 hours after the initial treatment, the knee had swollen up quite considerably. Uh, it had got red and black. So when they treated me that evening, I spent a lot of time getting the swelling down and restoring mobility because it, it had become very stiff. Um, by the time I had the MRI scan, I'd had three, I'd had three treatments. So it had made quite an improvement and a rapid improvement. Um, I was getting more, I had more mobility, I was still using the stick, but um, by the time I had the fourth treatment, fourth and fifth treatment, I'd had a lot of my mobility back. I had my sixth treatment in, in less than 10 days, and I was able to do away with the brace. I've got, I still wear a knee support just for confidence. Threw the stick away, I've got greater mobility, and I had my first gym sh uh, session again yesterday. So the healing has been very quick. Initially, when I saw the specialist, I was worried because if it was a tear, it suggested um, keyhole surgery. And I had heard that keyhole surgery can lead to many complications. And a lot of friends who've had it suggested not, not to get involved with it if I could. What's the time from the amount of time that's passed from when you have the injury to after the sixth um, treatment? Days. Just some, 10, 10 days. Okay, and a lot of that treatment was using the, the new technology. In fact, all the, all the uh, treatments involved that. Did you have to go and see the specialist again since uh, then? Being back to see the specialist, he had a look and he, he was surprised at the mobility. So he said, I'm not going to do anything. Um, come back and see me in two weeks. Um, and if the pain is still there, then we'll start with uh, injections and uh, we'll see what needs to be done next. But I've got to the stage now where the pain, there's no pain. Um, obviously, I haven't got 100% mobility, but Mihai thinks that it's safe to play golf and it was safe to have a gym session yesterday. And there's been no adverse reaction with the gym session. Have you had injuries before? Yes. And how does the treatment and the way that you've recovered this time compare with injuries you've had before? I had an injury previously on my ankle. I twisted it. Um, and it was just put in uh, plaster for a while. 
but it, you can notice the difference between the two ankles. One is very thick set because of it. Right. Uh, and Mia explained to me that the scar tissue and so on remains there. So th this is great because you know it's it's almost there. I'm not saying I'm there, but the mobility is back. I mean, my friends are surprised because the difference between the first week and today is incredible. I can move around. The first week I couldn't use public transport at all because I couldn't get upstairs, downstairs. Um, but this week is almost back to normal. Hesitate to say normal, but almost back to normal.